Hey, what's up, damn folk? Um, so I wanted to start doing something. I said I've been trying to work on making shorter content. I know it's super inconsistent, but I do want to start addressing the comments. I don't like, I don't got Twitter fan. I probably got arthritis. <laughs> but uh, what I want to start doing is just addressing the comments with a little bit more details to start making little shorts about, you know, certain comments that need to be addressed. Um, but there's one in particular. I want to show you this one that I found from the Cambria Derby video yesterday. And I kind of wanted to speak on it. And it says, every Walmart has greeters. How did the greeters and the people in the office watching surveillance videos miss the lady's entrance with the baby? That's what pisses me off. I hope she's suing Walmart because Walmart was neglectful. So I want to say shout out first and foremost to, uh, I believe that's Tessica, Tessica, uniquely made, 453 first. I appreciate you watching the video and I appreciate you commenting. But I have to vehemently disagree with you on this because... The tragedy started before she ever got to Walmart by leaving the home with the baby in that condition, by, you know, going out into those weather conditions with that child unclothed. That has nothing to do. I mean, something tragic could have happened before she ever got to Walmart while she was in the vehicle. Um, so I don't believe that's Walmart's responsibility. And the girl who took the video did get fired, unfortunately. And had she not have made this video, who knows what kind of action would have been taken, right? You have to have proof. Well, again, you also made a comment about CPS not doing enough. Um, this might have been the proof that CPS needed. But I also agree because I think CPS just gave the baby back to the mother. And again, so they're still in this condition. Um, so again, to me, the greeters are usually old people, right? Uh, not in the most cognitive adeptness, I guess you could say, if that's the right way of putting it, or, or somebody generally with a disability. So I don't think to put this responsibility on the greeters is one thing. And then to sit and assume that somebody is sitting and watching every single person as they enter the store, maybe more so as they're leaving the store would be a thing. I mean, you're, you're coming into the store, you probably don't have nothing, but you're leaving the store with what they're more concerned about. Um, so I, I find it hard to agree with you on that, but I do. Thank you for your opinion. I just think that your opinion is incorrect on this. So, did folks, let me know what y'all think. Is Walmart responsible? Um, should further action have been taken to address this matter? Or should Cambria Darby be suing Walmart and the uh, person who took the video for, you know, the actions and the grief and the distress that's caused? So, y'all let me know how you feel about that. With that being said, it's your boy, Hancho. I'm out.